Hello everyone, welcome back to Puff TV Studio, I'm Amin, and we are right here in Tallinn, Estonia, right in the heart of the Black Knights Film Festival. In this episode, we're gonna talk about a film, The Southern Chronicles, and the director of the film, Ignaz Mishkinis, is here to talk about the film a bit, a bit and uh, let us know what is happening in the film. So, how are you doing? I'm fine, thanks you. All right, so how do you feel in Estonia? Uh, it's not my first time in sure. Tallinn, but but last time was maybe I don't know 15 years ago. So Tallinn changed a little bit, <laughs> not a little bit, just a little bit. No, no, <laughs> much. <laughs> All right, okay, let's go and uh, open up the topic about the film. So first, let's talk about the title of the film and the novel that you got the idea of the film out of that. So let's combine these two questions and let's talk about it. Okay, so the, the film is based on a novel, mm. uh, very popular in, in, in Lithuania, and oh, the, the novel also translated in, in, into other languages, uh, Ukraine, uh, German, I don't remember the all translations. But actually it was a bestseller in, in, in Lithuania, and, and it wasn't my idea to make a movie on that novel. Uh, that the idea was from producer Lucas Trimonis and a scriptwriter Agle Vertelita. Mm -hmm. So they 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 took a book. They they, they did the, the script and something happened. So they waited for one year and then they invited me to join the project. So this was the first time when I when I uh, like step into the project, not, sure. not to not start it from, yeah, from yeah. the beginning. Okay, so it new was experience. such a brief uh, explanation. Just something happened and <laughs> I get <could> wait. <laughs> All right, okay. So um, let's go a bit further and the content of the film. Uh, so uh, the main character, uh, he's in, in a high school last year, he's 18. It's a 90s crazy time, completely crazy time in Lithuania. Uh, it, 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 Lithuania just got the independence and, you know, wild, 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 wild times. And uh, he's, a, uh, he's a rugby player and uh, everything is changing uh, for him and uh, uh, slowly he discovering uh, new new things in his life uh, like love and also literature and step by step he's becoming a different person <laughs> okay so it's a coming of age we can say uh, i don't know how to, <laughs> how to say correctly the genre so maybe it's a comedy uh, kind of comedy with the salt yeah oh we can talk about it yeah we can we can uh basically discover a bit more about it but let, let's take it uh like for other questions okay. for now let's talk about the casting and uh, the actors you have uh, taken to the work so how was the project how was the process basically of uh, getting actors casting and then choosing them what was those filters and sortings you have uh, had it in your mind that mm -hmm. okay I'm, if they had this i'm gonna take them to the film okay and uh, yeah those sort of symbols you're search you were searching for so if to pay attention to at, at, at this visual uh, topic so uh, people young people in 90s they 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 look completely different from 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 this year exactly I mean, true yeah, yeah, uh, uh, high school uh, uh, youngsters. So uh, I was looking something uh, not so soft in the faces. And another thing, if you if you uh, would take a, a picture from high school in nineties, you you will you will see that the the people <laughs> look much older. True. Like aunts and uncles in, in the picture. Yeah, yeah. true, true. So uh, this was like also kind of approach to this and of course another thing it was like basically like i was looking for talented actors and for the main character i was looking for an, a, an actor who can do sports and in the past he was a uh, handball player handball player all right yeah and 
but then he got uh, trauma injury and uh, he went to acting so for him to start play rugby was not so difficult actually okay but he got injured again during shooting <laughs> oh my god <laughs> <laughs> okay so i was about to ask the challenges he already yeah. <laughs> told one of those but this was the only challenge or uh, not the only but yes of course for jugas for the main actor that was really painful and for us also we we have to i would say to take care of it also somehow to to adapt to okay. to his to his poor painful leg mm -hmm. um so if you had this possibility to go back in time uh is there any scene or part of the film that you would like to add or remove or you wouldn't even touch the film no uh, i mean film is done and then and, and i removed uh, a lot during shooting and during preparation and uh, removed and put it back uh, i mean th that was really uh, long uh, long uh, period uh, and and i mean uh, the, the process took a long time to make that film o also the, the preparation uh, took very long because i had to to go through archives to to look for the material to to look for locations because it's not 90s anymore <laughs> you know? yeah yeah exactly and uh, uh, but uh, one thing <laughs> it's a hard question i don't know maybe I have an episode. Uh, this is the 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 end of the film, and in that episode, uh, there is a, a couple of of of, uh, of people in the in the. Okay, I'm I'm, I'm spoiling here. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you no, you so, don't need actually. Uh, 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 if I could change, I, I would. I would uh, ask my my uh, my friends to do that role now. I mean, ah, okay, okay. special to ask my teachers to do that uh -huh, role. Okay. So, but it's you know it's it's so com complex to it's complicated to to explain what what I would like to change. So maybe it's all right. Bad answer. Sorry. <laughs> no worries. No, I mean this is how you want to answer it. No, no, there's no <laughs> exact so, like so a default answer. I, I, I would, I don't want to change anything. All right. So you don't want to touch it, though. Yeah. That's all. All right. This is done. Okay. Let's move. Let's to keep another. it. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. All right. Uh, so um, as you mentioned the locations, so how? But I, I know that you just told that it's it was from pictures and archives that you checked out. How the 90s looked like, so you could actually manage to make it in a way that looks like that. But uh, what was those challenges that you have faced in terms of making the visuals of the film same mm -hmm. as it exactly looks like 90s? So uh, one thing is, you know, uh, it's a. I mean, also here in Thailand. I told you before, uh, just in the beginning, that uh, the last time I was here, it, it looked completely different. It was 15 years ago. Yeah, exactly. And uh, and it's the same in Lithuania. I mean, you, you you're choosing the place, and in one month, you're coming back, and there is a construction there. I mean, everything is changing, yeah, yeah. And, and you have to adapt. You have to to, to move fast, and and of course uh, you, you have to think about the budget because you don't have the post production possibilities like in in su super mega movie, and so it's a game, but it's a interesting game and a funny game. Okay, all right. Thank you so much for coming up. Such a Thank wonderful you. pleasure to have you here. Thank you. Thank you. And once again, thank you so much for watching us. Check our social media and one more time to say that a couple of days of puff is remaining. So uh, get this golden opportunity and go watch the films which are having a screening is still in the puff. And that's pretty much it till another interview. Peace out.